My name Jason, I am 31 and I have dystonia. Dystonia feels like when you tell your body to do something but it does something else. There are about 640 muscles that move the human body. Jason estimates that up to 500 of his muscles stay continually flexed, twisting his body into unusual positions. Wanna say hi to Jason? Aww. And gripping the muscles that control his vocal cords. <laughs> okay, you be good. Is that okay? <laughs> Dystonia feels like the most annoying thing that you can imagine. Though Jason's muscles don't behave, they are ordinary in structure and function. Like typical muscles, they're made of bundles of muscle fiber. Each fiber gets command signals from the brain through wire-like nerve cells. When a command arrives to take a step, each targeted nerve cell releases chemicals onto muscle fibers, causing them to contract. And when bundles of fibers contract at the same time, the whole muscle contracts, producing the miracle of body movement. The more signals sent from the brain, the more the muscle contracts, and the bigger the movement. But for reasons science doesn't understand, Jason's brain is constantly sending faulty commands to his muscles. As a result, they contract outside his control. Welcome, everybody. Welcome to Chicago. Thank Very you. little is known about what causes dystonia or how to treat it. I'm sure that many of you have questions on how it works. To learn more about his mysterious condition, Jason attends a dystonia conference. Here, he can trade information with other dystonia patients and talk to some of the leading experts on the condition. Hello, Jason. Hi, my friend. I heard a lot of you. Because Jason can barely speak, he communicates with a speech synthesizer. For each comment he makes, the process can take a minute or more. No, but now I'm seeing Dr. Vidak at Cleveland Clinic. Oh, great. So you're seeing Jerry. Jerry's phenomenal. He's a really a great, great guy. First of all, he's a great person. And he's a, obviously one of the major experts. Although dystonia strangles Jason's speech, he's not affected intellectually. Jason is a typical patient with dystonia because you immediately have the impression of a human being trapped in his body. Nice meeting you. But with a very, very crisp mind. He's clearly very smart. Ready? Mm -hmm. 